Howdy, folks. It's 310 on Sunday afternoon, October 15. And I uh, wanted to just give you guys a little bit of an overview. I keep talking about these soffit vents that I'm making. Well, it all starts out with a board about like that. And then I cut them down to about this size. And what I do is I um, <clears throat> cut them on my table saw, run them through the planer, and then varnish the thinnest two sides. Then what I do is I cut a bunch of spacers. And then what I do is I take those spacers and I glue them on to the boards. And I have a stick that I put in between so that I know where the next spacer goes. When I'm done, because I've only planed two sides, I end up with something that looks like this. And what I then do is run that through the planer. And uh, after it's all dry, because what's happened is I use this pin nailer. You can just barely see the three little pin nails that I put on. And I put those on, I glue this piece, and I then pin nail it so that I end up with these kind of spaces. When it's all done and dried, what I then do is I run it through the, the planer and then trim off the ends. And that's the, sort of the start of the um, um, vent. I'll end up putting some screening and some hardware mesh on the back. But then what I'll do is I, uh, I'll frame it out. And again, this is just another two by six that I, or two by four maybe in this case. And what I'll do is I'll frame it out with this so that it covers the last um, strip <clears throat> on either side and then a little bit on the ends and uh, sand it down and varnish it and the like so uh, this is one that I did the other night and I've uh, I planed I did it on Saturday and I planed it so that I can um, test my theory on it and what happens is this piece here is a bit longer than the actual strip that slots in there. And the reason is I'm going to have some hardware mesh then and screening on that. So that'll fill some of that hole, some of that space. And then what I'll do, because you can see I have a pretty thick spot there, what I'll then do is from the from the, the top, I'll say, I'll drill a pilot hole and countersink it so that when I'm ready to put these up, I can just screw them right to the soffit material. So that's uh, how I'm building the vents.